How about that ride, Al? I was just thinking about when we, as we were pulling up here, I was like, man, it was like three full days of riding, truthfully. It really was. <laughs> you know what? This is what I'm talking about. It's, it's called going with the flow, man. It's about the flow. Tell me more about that. Flow, dude. <laughs> you got to just go with it. They, they, they tell you, they've been saying it my whole life, fight the, fight the current and drown, you know? God, it's so true. Come on. Am I on your way? You gotta move this. You gotta move this all the way. <laughs> Love choppers. Always will love choppers. You'll not. You'll. You're hard pressed to have more fun on a motorcycle than riding on like. I could even add a shovel and chopper on top of all that, but they're the best. I say that like 25 times a day. <laughs> <laughs> so I was like, this is a fucking sick cycle right here. <laughs> You've gotten out more than anybody I know. So trying to. Yeah. Well, I'm glad you did because it drug a lot of us out to some places we would have never found otherwise. Yeah, we, my dad was a full bum. Like, just like in the winter, my mom would let him be gone. He'd be leave all winter and live in Utah. Keys oh to the my kingdom, God, man. that was the first bike of the clutch, just right there. Yeah. We were just like, what? Like, 7 a.m., kick the door down, just like, wing, ding, 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 ding. <laughs> like, ripping him up and down the street. It was insane. I got it. Okay. been out on the road all summer meeting people and I think people are just willing to help you all, yeah. all the time I think people are like truly good to their core just love being a biker I just want to ride live under the radar as best as I can you know what I mean I feel like I have friends in every state because we share this common thing Did you see that one? yeah where we're at right now in the desert like I grew up out here because every fucking weekend he would take the whole neighborhood, you know, me and my brothers and the whole, any kid that was available hop in the truck and we'd come out here and shoot guns, ride dirt bikes. My ears were still ringing, I think, from uh, popping some caps in the <gasps> desert with Gosh. you. I'm still goofing. <laughs> yeah. Then a few minutes later, I'm in like ultimate like crystal zen zone. Oh, fuck it up. not like as in tune obviously as he is but the vibrations i was feeling them i feel them. i was feeling them it's all about that flow baby it's Trying all about that, that flow. flow i asked him i was like do you think like yeah. all that acid and shit you eat is like detrimental to you he just looked at me in the straight in the face and was like it's medicine what are you talking about <laughs> <laughs> Here I am getting sound baths and cruising with crystals. You get one little crystal. Yeah, I was like, give me the give me the fucking coconut. Let me try the coconut, spicy coconut. <laughs> Keep an open mind. <laughs> give me that LSD. <laughs> <laughs> Those mushrooms in my ramen. It'll help. I mean Austin said last night, he's like, his most favorite thing in the whole world. There's nothing more favorite to him than riding choppers and camping. <laughs> and then he gift gifted yeah. me this little quartz crystal. And he said, it's non-judgmental, so I should keep it with me. <laughs> <laughs> I love that. You should be a park I, ranger. I've led, I've led a few few y'all. You have. Just this morning. This morning was a great hike. I think that's part of the reason the ride was so good, actually. Dude! I got a little turned around when we were down in the cracks. I was <laughs> like, wait a minute. We went to Joshua Tree a lot. And we, I mean, we've been to every place in the whole damn, you know, every uh, campsite. But that's like our spot. Like, that is our spot. And at the very top, in the back, it's called the chair. We're in Lion Country. And you gotta climb up there, and there's a couple tedious spots, <laughs> a little hairy spots. But when you sit, when you get to the top, you sit in this rock, and it's like a carved out, like a little sofa in the rock, and your feet dangled like 100 feet off the ground or something. 
it's an epic view of the valley. It's pretty cool. But it was like that perfect combination of like morning light, empty blacktop, you know, windy roads, like crazy views, like this ride gives you everything. It it's does. like the American dream chopper dream. Yeah.